Hi, it's Jason Zubak, five-time Remax World Long Drive Champion with another golf tip for Golf Tips Magazine. Now, garnering a lot of tension as of late, you hear all the guy, tour guys talking about a lot of the coaches, the stack and tilt philosophy. I'd like to simplify that and just call it turning around a central axis, meaning when we're trying to generate the maximum amount of power, we don't really want to sway too far off the golf ball. When we sway too far off the golf ball, we tend to lose our contact meaning inconsistent contact, hitting it all over the face, not getting as much energy transfer. But as well, what we lose is some of that coil, some of the tension that is created, some of that torque that helps propel our body and eventually the golf ball with the maximum golf ball velocity. Now I've looked at video, I, I'm a scientist, uh, my background is a pharmacist, and I look at a lot of data from all over. I look at the best, longest hitters on the PJ Tour, guys that have hit it long time, hit it real far a long time ago, to current guys that really bash it out there, as well as the current long drive champions. And without a doubt, one of the constant things that they do that you can emulate in your own swing is they turn around that central axis. They're not swaying too far off the golf ball. A little movement's okay, but we're moving a long ways away. We're losing power, we're losing contact, ultimately losing distance and velocity. What I have here is just a couple shafts, one placed on the ball of my foot on my right foot, one at the ball of the foot on my left foot. Now I'm teeing this one up and I'm going to make a swing. I don't want to get my thigh to this shaft. I want to turn inside that and I want to get aggressively through to that front shaft, get my left hip through that front shaft as well. So let's put that all together. You know, turn, we want to keep that head central, turn around our central axis, meaning keep our head central, we want to make that turn. See our weight gets shifted no matter what. As long as we make a good shoulder turn, we shift our weight fine. We want to avoid swaying a, a, a large distance away from the golf ball. So when we tee it up, take a nice light grip on the club. Now, big thing about just keeping our head relatively steady. And get through the golf ball. That's a pretty good one. That's uh, right in the center of the grid. Might win you a world championship.